Pusak is smack in the middle of nowhere, a dusty little town where there obviously isn't a lot to do. And the driver who's supposed to meet me is nowhere to be found. Eventually, a store owner takes pity on me and offers me floor space in her little shop. I wait till she's asleep. I know I'm a bit weird about this, but I bathe every day. I really I hate worse than cold water. It's being dirty. She opens at the crack of dawn, but at least my ride is here. Though not exactly the chariot I've been hoping for. Is that the spare tire? Oh. oh my god. Un poquito viejo, no? Mm -hmm. Smooth as a baby's bottom. The owner doesn't seem the slightest bit concerned. Mm -hmm. He knows he's the only ride in town. Get a load of this. Good lord, this car is a death trap. Santiago is more than just a taxi driver. He's a lifeline between villages that have few phones and fewer roads. He's the general store and switchboard operator, wheeling and dealing, and sometimes stealing. <laughs> Poor thing. I don't believe it. He just stole a cat. <laughs> He's going to give it to his daughter. He'll bring the owner some avocados on his way back. Once they've been properly introduced, he sings us both to sleep with an endless supply of Spanish love songs. <laughs> Nació en la montaña donde el aire puro y el agua cristalina de sus manantiales. 